Hello, Andy here from Recreational Barrel Works uh, to tell you about one of our new products for 2021, which is the Tripper model canoe pack. So the Tripper's a great um, tough canoe pack that is made of thousand denier cordura um, all the way around and even a double layer on the bottom. Um, some of the features of this canoe pack, which is is basically a, a, uh, a basic canoe pack, uh, great for beginners or uh, a general use canoe pack. Um, it, it has things like five high visibility handles that uh, are made out of this yellow webbing, two on the side, one here in the front, and there's two here in the back. So uh, ideally you're gonna find a handle to help um, uh, lift it in and out of your canoe or around the campsite um, as you're going. A couple of other features include things like lash points to uh, clip your map or your water bottle on here when you hit the portage. And uh, the suspension system here in the back is uh, a basic but comfortable padded foam shoulder straps that uh, has a sternum strap here that's adjustable so you can um, move this up and down, get it in the right spot uh, as you're uh, portaging through uh, the day with different layers of clothes on. That makes it adjustable uh, here and there. The other uh, interesting thing about this pack is it just has a very basic uh, hip belt. It, show you that it's a, a, a two inch webbing hip belt which is removable so if you're not the type of uh, person that wants a, a hip belt on your canoe pack no problem you can unthread that and uh, leave it at home uh, or you can adjust it in a couple of different ways which i'll show you in a minute a couple of the other features before i start modeling are uh, the lid um, there is a lid closure for this pack that you can shorten through these two adjuster straps here. Um, shortening it up or lengthening the lid depending on how full you've made your pack. Uh, the pack closes using these two, two um, buckles on the front and opens to uh, show a cuff inside that uh, you can fill um, this pack up a little higher than the, the normal height uh, by putting your excess items up here in the, in the cuff. Um, and that closes and gets compressed by three straps. One that goes over the middle um, and then two that go from front to back. So, and when you unclip those, you expose a drawstring closure for the cuff that uh, allows you to get into the main body of the pack, which has all the seams taped and uh, so there's no uh, exposed threads that are catching on your gear or uh, getting worn. And oh, my pillow. Mm -hmm. All right, now I'm gonna show you um, how uh, how it fits on. Clip. Clip. All right, so I'll pop this beast on. And now the interesting thing about this hip belt is it's dual adjustability. So you can adjust it by pulling these straps to make this tighter, um, this, these ends of the straps, or if you reach back and grab this end of the strap uh, closer to the pack, 
and you pull it forward, it will also snug up your hip belt that way. So whichever way you like, whether it's pulling uh, this way or this way, you've got options. So. There we go. Now this pack also has, you can see hopefully just over my, uh, sh just to the, the sides of the shoulder strap, there's a couple of buckles. On those buckles, you can attach uh, an optional tump line if, uh, if a tump line is something you like to uh, have on your pack. So you would thread each end through that buckle on each side and uh, and then uh, you'd have the tump line and you can adjust it uh, um, and and have that to help carry the load transfers the weight directly um, to your through your forehead to your spine and uh, take some of the load rather than it all being on shoulder straps and hip belt that is the Tripper Canoe Pack. Did your wife choose the color of your shirt? No. This, this is my, we're going south to Cuba, honey shirt. No, we're not. Mm.